I'm Anil Kumar sharing with you questions where application of logarithmic differentiation helps to simplify the solution. We need to find derivative of the function y equals to 2x minus 1 to the power of 4 times x cubed minus 3 to the power of 5. You can always solve this using product rule, chain rule and the combination of these. But we could also take logarithms on both sides and then simplify the given function and then find the derivative. So the steps here are take logarithm. So we now already take natural log on both sides. And then the idea is to simplify and then find derivative with respect to x. Right? These are the steps which we can follow to simplify a solution. Let me show you how. If I take log on both the sides for the function, what do we get? We get ln y equals to ln. Let me write down this function as such first. 2x minus 1 to the power of 4, x cubed minus 3 to the power of 5. Now, if you apply the rules for logarithms, this is the product, right? So it becomes the sum. Here is the power 4. So I could write this as 4 ln 2x minus 1 plus 5 ln x cubed minus 3, right? Is that clear? ln y. So we applied the combination of power rule and the product rule. So we get 4 times ln 2x minus 1. Since this is a product, it could be written as sum of logarithms, right? 5 times ln x cubed minus 3. Now at this stage, we'll take derivative with respect to x on both the sides. Now what is the derivative for ln y? Let me write d dx of, of ln x. That will be equals to 1 over x. For ln y, it will be 1 over y dy dx, correct? So we can write this as 1 over y. And let me write this as dy dx. Now, on the right side, 4 times ln 2x minus 1. 4 is a constant. Derivative of this is 1 over 2x minus 1 times the derivative of inside function over just 2 plus 5 times 1 over x cube minus 3 times derivative of x cube which is 3 x square correct so so that is how you could do it so we have really avoided a lot of complications in this fashion now we can simplify this a bit we say dy dx is equals to y times within brackets let me write down this 4 times 2 is 8 so we get 8 over 2x minus 1 plus 5 times 3 is 15 so 15 x square over x cubed minus 3 now you can replace y with the original function which is 2x minus 1 to the power of 4 times x cubed minus 3 to the power of 5 and with the brackets we get 8 over 2x minus 1 plus 15x square over x cubed minus 3 right so that becomes your answer so that is how you can actually find derivative of some functions using logarithms on both the sides. I'm Anil Kumar. I hope that helps. Thank you and all the best.